Hey, Momo, our producer, she's very excited. All right, let's take a look outside. Uh, we have just hazy skies overhead right now. A lot of folks still out and about for the afternoon. It's 70 degrees. Uh, the weather observation system that gives us these uh, various OBS is saying it's cloudy, but that's actually smoke. It's hazy conditions that we have in play. Roads are clear right now. Just a few little slowdowns here and there around northern Ohio, but no accidents to speak of. The big picture shows that we don't have a lot of cloud cover, so we do have clear skies, except we have that whole smoke thing that's happening. And the vertically integrated smoke that's sensed by the satellite shows you where the biggest concentration of smoke is. And this is what we had come through earlier today. If you looked outside, you went, man, it's cloudy today. There was like no sun making it through when this batch was coming through. That has since moved south. And now we kind of have that dimly lit haze that is continuing in the area right now. This is not the end of it. As a matter of fact, we have more of this smoke that's coming because you can see we have more hot spots that are being generated. Not only that, but if we bring in the Canadian Wildland Fire Information System, these are active wildfires right now in eastern Canada. So here's Ottawa. Uh, Toronto is down here. So we're up into central portions of Quebec. There's the city of Quebec. And you can see all of these fires and anything that is one of these larger circles, that is over a thousand acres. So there's a lot that is on fire here. And all of that smoke has to go somewhere. It goes up, gets mixed into the atmosphere, and then it is wind driven from there. So we go up to 15,000 feet to see where the wind is coming from, and it's coming straight out of the north. There's an area of low pressure on the east coast that's pushing all of that air back our way, and so we end up becoming the in uh, on the receiving end of all of that smoke. There's that area of low pressure on the east coast. That is going to clog the works once again, so a very stagnant weather pattern is set up. It does look like maybe longer range we could get some rain in here, but for tomorrow we're going partly cloudy. Temps in the 70s. We're going to hold the temperatures down in your National Design Mart hour by hour forecast because of the smoke. It's got a very high reflective value in the atmosphere, uh, so it just reflects the incoming sunlight, but you can see we'll have light northerly winds too. And I mentioned the rain chances. Well, there's a chance maybe by the end of the weekend, fingers crossed, that we get some rain in here. Here's your Union Home Mortgage forecast, and you kind of see the way the temperatures go as we have that fog, or excuse me, as we have that smoke in in place that's going to hold those temperatures down in the low 70s through the week. We'll get some heating in here that'll help to mix the smoke out, but it also brings us that slight chance for some rain by the end of the weekend. We'll have more What's New coming up next.